And going to be fairly mild, relatively speaking. 41 will start it in Warsaw. Compare that to 26 in Kansas City. Compare that to 18 to start it in Hiawatha. You get the idea that Tuesday is going to be pretty cold. Here's a look at the 12 hour breakdown for you. Staying in the 20s, still a chance of some freezing drizzle in the morning. I'm hoping that most bridges and overpasses have been treated and the surface temperatures of the pavement were able to rise quite a bit because of all the sunshine we had today in the warmer conditions. However, we already have the yellow triangle up there impacting you for Wednesday night, that time period through Thursday. Snow is likely, it'll be the powdery fluffy type not necessarily going to accumulate much because of the temperature being so cold. Light accumulations are still possible. And also, I always say that it took Mother Nature many days to make that last storm system. This one's right on its heels, so it's not going to have a chance to really mature. That's what we're going for. Here's a look at First Alert Future Scan talking about Wednesday. This is now into Thursday morning. More of a icy mix down toward Joplin and Springfield. We're on the fringes of the storm system. Light snow for the morning commute, still out there for the afternoon as well. Then the system starts to move out pretty quickly, hopefully by the evening drive. And again, I don't think that the snow amounts are going to be as significant as we saw before. And I don't think we have to worry about thunder and lightning at the same time we're getting snow. That's usually when the amounts really go up quite a bit. Temperatures going down quite a bit. 26 to 28 degrees on your Tuesday. That chance of freezing drizzle in the morning. Nick will be here tomorrow morning to get you through it. 8 to 25 on Wednesday. There's the impact day on Thursday with a high of 25. Look at the rest of the nine day forecast. Our normal high should be about 46 this time of year. We don't get there until possibly Tuesday and Wednesday of next week when we get back into the 50s. And even the mornings start pretty cold. Wednesday morning, single digits. Friday morning, single digits too.